Well, Buck, a, a tough start for Ribaldo. What did you see early on? Yeah, he went very good. Yeah, I think you saw it. He had to keep waiting for him to get in step a little bit and give us some innings, give us a chance, but just never seemed to find his way. And uh, just not much command there and a lot of counts against him. And you know, he had a couple of situations that were out of his control, but, uh, you know, he just didn't respond very well. You know, usually he gets in step and gives us some innings. That didn't happen today, but we got a great outing from Worley. Yeah. Well, what's the next step for Ibaldo? Do, do you send him out and hope he finds the command? Send him out where? The next start? Oh, I don't know. We, we look every time after we get through things, see what's our best way to go forward, and we'll do that again and uh, see where we are. But, uh, you know, we can't know he's capable of better. It didn't happen today. This is the second time in about 10 days Vance Worley has done that for you, eating up the innings, and at a minimum, he saves your bullpen for tomorrow. He was outstanding. Well, yeah, I don't know about saves, but uh, he put us in a position, you know, especially with uh, some tough games coming up after tomorrow. This is a good offensive team and uh, uh, kept us from having to use a lot of people, but at the same point, we're a, a early start from being in that same situation. We're going to have to look at whether we need to make some moves or not, but uh, we've got both our clubs playing right now, so... Hopefully we're ahead of that. Are you concerned about uh, the depth in the bullpen is, uh, even for tomorrow? Oh, always. You're always concerned that when you get a short start because it puts some people uh, in position having to pitch when they, they shouldn't have to pitch. But uh, you know, nobody knows that more than your ball, though, and I know it, it bothers him. And finally, uh, early deficit, but uh, the team really did have some quality at bats at trying to chip back in. Well, you got a guy that's what fourth in American League in pitching, pitching, and uh, you know we had a couple of men on second, nobody out, didn't mm -hmm. score, had bases loaded, and nobody out, and only pushed one across. So we had some opportunities to get back in that game, and I was real proud of that. And uh, but we couldn't capitalize. On, you know, he's a good pitcher. I mean, he uh, one of the better pitchers very quietly in American League. All right, Buck. Appreciate the visit. Okay, thank you.